everyone and a special hello to you that's watching this video um, okay today it's time to move in to the kitchen i'm finished with the kitchen it's just a few minor stuff i still want to do here and um i just pack out all the stuff that i already have for my kitchen um cutlery even food and all that stuff some of this it's came with the patio set my daughter still had and gave to me uh, um like I mean, look at this little cute small um knives and you know it's and i can't believe everything is still here from and this patio set she had when she was a child so yeah it's very old and then um some of the stuff came with the set like the kitchen set i bought um yes yeah, so it was also food and like the pots and pans and even dining room set and add more well plates and cups not um okay and this was the but this is not to scale for barbie this is actually for me a little bit too big but yeah that came also with the set and some of the stuff i made myself so um i um actually i didn't want to wait until the ceiling is up to put this cupboard on because I wanted to paste this cupboard moss against the ceiling. Well, I didn't really actually want to do that, but I thought oh, well, that's the only option to have it stable without putting like the sticks like I previously had again here. Yeah. So I had actually had epiphany. So um, I'm going to put it up now. I'm going to paste it here against the wall, but then I've got this little small magnet that um, i'm going to put on the top here and then when i put a ceiling i'm going to put a magnet on the ceiling as well so this then that will help to keep this cupboard stable but for now i'm going to just be careful but i'm going to put it up here against the um the, the wall now then i can put my stuff in as well so and then the blind um i will, must also put it up here um it was a blind that was previously, I made it previously, I put it here in the kitchen. I actually made it from a placemat that I, well, I had, I had uh, old placemats at the time. Uh, each one was a different one and luckily almost all those placemats I can use in my Barbie home. So yeah, I made it from this placemat and this blind even works. If you pull on the string, it will, um, okay, maybe I must just my other hand. If you pull on the string, it even moves up, it opens. So yeah, um, I just had to make a few changes um, from, well, then I had to, I wanted to make a few changes um, from how it looked before. So here's a quick video to show you um, uh, what I did. Okay, so now that you see I changed, I actually just had to cut off an outer piece here because it, I had a problem, it didn't want to fit here by the window because of this little wall I put up here, it, um, now, made, it's now in the window, so I just had cut it out a piece, so I'm going to put it underneath there and then paste that here, and then this is just a um, popsicle um, lollipop 
um, little tube and wire i'm gonna fold that and i'm gonna put it up here somewhere for um my um hand towels for the kitchen so that's the stuff i'm gonna uh, still have to do and then the rest is just to pack away all the stuff so yeah let's get started Okay, I'm so happy with this. It's up now against the wall and I'm so glad I changed this kitchen. So yeah, now I can start to put away all the, the stuff that um, in the cupboards must find places. You know, when it's like when you're moving into a new kitchen or a new home, then you're struggling to find places for all, for all your stuff in your kitchen. So yeah. Um, okay, so I'm... Um, gonna show and tell um, I'm gonna start from one side and move my way around the kitchen so um, I think in this first cupboard like the previous time I'm gonna put the um, cutlery the plates and cups and all that stuff in here um, this actually came with the, the set just to um, I think this one is actually too big yeah, this one is too big, that's why it's not inside here. Okay. I think this is the why the, the dust dustpan. I actually put a little rack in here so you can put your dustpan bags or something on top of there. 
and this little dustbin is just a normal um, tablet container that I sprayed silver and then I made this little black bag out of it. Uh, a bag just paste it with cut it to size and paste it with um, salutite so there is my little dustbin with a dustbin bag so this was a, a metal teapot that came with the patio set it was white I just sprayed it silver and I decided to use this as a vase for flowers but now I'm going to change this flowers a bit and I think flowers that is freshly picked from our garden the purple ones so I think I'm just going to in this drawer here it's just a matchbox for those large matches that I used here on the cupboard so I used to make the drawer according to the size of the inside of the matchbox and I just put it with a white sticky tape on the inside just to make it white and you all know what I did on the front so for this one I'm going to put this oversized um, cutlery that came with the um, kitchen set I think just think it's too big for Barbie so I'm going to put that here and then yeah and it's in the second one this is just um, also that same matchbox I just put a carton in the middle to divide it in two so I'm going to put in a one this came with the patio set um, from my daughter so this is actually the right size and then this one as well that's hanging here on the shelf here that's also this came with that so yeah I'm going to leave that one there I'll put this in oops in here no and this i don't know where it came from it was between my daughter's patio set that i think i'm going to use it as salad for salad a salad um fork and spoon so i'm going to put it on that side and then on the top drawer this is normal matchboxes also just the inside i just put basically three next to each other to also divide the drawers so yeah and i've got all this beautiful it's actually so cute little small um spoons and forks and knives that came with the patio set and everything is still there after 20 odd years so yeah um, I just cut this little dish cloth I cut it a little small, um, smaller to fit in here by this um, one I made here it actually come from it's like a special um, dust cloth you get and this actually works awesome for um, towels and all that stuff and I've got it in every room almost because I've got all colors today it's like you buy it in a bunch of buy five get one free at a local hardware store so I bought that for towels and then even kitchen towels so I'm just going to put that back in there so, so I made small ones and then yeah somewhere where is that now i oh, just for now i made a little small just with a bead beads um little dishwasher container just to put here but i'm going to make dishwasher oh, not dishwasher 
<laughs> I'm used to dishwasher. Liquid soap, kitchen soap or um, sunlight liquid like we call it. But I will make a real one. Well, not real, real, but yeah, I will wait. And um, in this cupboard here, I'm going to put a, the pots and the pans. And then this is some just extra um well I this was the first um dish cloth that I made for the kitchen but I've this before I added towels so I think I'm going to just put it in this drawer here and then yeah I've got this extra kitchen carpet here by the smooth oh, so it won't fit in there okay and um, oh yeah I've got like this little tray here and this one here I actually got this little box that is so cute um, I don't know where to use it, but it's because of the wood for now and the lid can even come off. So, um, it's actually so cute. My husband buys seeds in that, so I'm going to put it somewhere in the corner here for now until I find a nice space for that. So this is just a tray with like donuts or something in it. I'm going to also put it here by the trailer if drawer. Um, what else? Okay, normally I add wine glasses in here. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna still put it in here. I actually want to put the wine glasses in the in the bar, in the patula upper side. Um, maybe I must just put this here because I am going to put some wine here in the fridge. Okay, and this, um, I think, actually, this colorful ones came in, like, Christmas crackers um, all those years ago. You know, it was still small, and um, I'm going to put this in the in the bar, uh, in my lapa. So, yeah, let me just get that one before Chloe gets it. This is actually um a fridge magnet that I I bought. I've got a bought a few of them. Uh, some more here. It's when I've just started with the doorhouse, I saw this at one in one of the but crazy stores, the store's name. I saw that the fridge magnets with the wine bottles inside. And I said that's a perfect si scale size for Barbie. So I'm gonna put that in the bar bar of Lapa. But I think I'm still going to have to twist loose here. I'm gonna put a red and a white wine in the fridge in the kitchen for when they're relaxing here now to go to the patio. So yeah, gonna be in the door. Gonna put the wine in the door. The kitchen, I was just plastic and things. I sprayed it silver. And the inside, I didn't like the the silver, the plasticky inside. Um, okay, this was inside here, yeah, white plastic, but in the doors, it was now pink. All the doors were pink. So I put like um, that foam board on the inside and even, yeah, the back, just to look, like, so that it can look more like a fridge. And then always I put a racks here yeah, in the door. And I have had this little containers um from something 
and it actually fits perfectly inside a kitchen like a, um, a vegetable tray or something okay i don't have any vegetables now so i'm gonna say this is maybe potatoes so i'm gonna put that in here and then um this is all meaty stuff this all came with the the um barbecue set all the meats so i'm gonna put that in the deep freeze in the freezer here underneath and this is small little fish i don't know where that came from i'm gonna put that also in the freezer um that is bread so this is bread with butter i, I had an egg i know i had an egg somewhere that's just i don't know where it is now i'm gonna put that in the side here not in the fridge um, maybe i must put that in this plate in the fridge no i'm just put bread like that in the fridge now and this is a little cake or tart that came with the set so i'm gonna put that some on that side there um this is still one of those glass bottles now i actually have nothing to put in this little cupboard here <laughs> and i must put this glass bottles in there for now just some of them uh, maybe this will fit in there this is also part of this porcelain tea set i've got um i just didn't have space here for that and i don't know if i'm gonna use it here maybe just put it here for now yeah okay that will actually work perfect yeah so i don't have anything to put there now so maybe i must just i oh, say that looks actually nice okay so let's put this spain here I am going to make um, still food and my own plates and cups and all that stuff for in the future. But for now, this must not be enough. Let me just put this one in here. And this is bowls. I think this one came with the set. I don't know. Well, I don't know where that came from, but it, I, well, it came with the patio set for my daughter. Maybe I must put that here. It's just to have something on top. Okay, so this I made myself. Um, it's a little bread bin that I made out of wood. Um, can open like that. I actually, well, my niece gave me this some bread buns, or what came with the patio set. Some buns in there, and maybe I must put this two bread rolls in there as well. This is actually it's like Legos. It came our one of our stores had a um, thing that's running. If you buy something on and I want to run for every hour and run, you get the little bag with few Lego blocks inside that to build your own shop. And then this, oh, that's where that fish came from. It was also in there. And then this bread I've got. So I'm going to put that in here as well. And then this, like I said, I made out of wood. It's actually my niece gave me um, a lot of wood um, toys. But it's one to scale, uh, one to 12 scale furniture for a dollhouse like this little cute little chairs but it's too small to use in a bobby house some of the stuff i can use in yeah i actually took it out and then some of the stuff like this i can't use um so i took off that and i cut it up that's why this groove is in there i use like roof like like grooves like this so it is a groove already in there and it's the same of that that i used here for my tv stand as well so, and I just spread it silver, so there's a little bread bin. And um, then this is my toaster. The handle actually broke off. This came with the set, it was all white. So I sprayed the toaster silver and they 
red I cut it in with brown so it's going to look like toast but now of course the little spring went missing when I opened it um, so the bread stays inside the thing now but yeah there is bread in there so uh, there's my bit of toast I'm going to put it on that side of the and um, this I don't know where it is I don't know where I got it I don't know what it is but I saw Barbie in that of the shape of it it was green actually and it was actually perfect for like a hot plate so I just sprayed it black and I put some red cutics on that side there so now it's like a little hot plate I'm actually thinking of just put a little wire so for electric and I'm going to put sockets still here in the kitchen one day but yeah I'm going to use that as a little hot plate and um, this is my little kettle I made um, it's just like a little um, for deodorant a cup for on your deodorant just cut it off a bit and um, put some um, foam board oh no this is a little piece of wood yeah a round circle of wood in, on the inside and I don't even oh this is the back of a pen I used for on the wire but there are these my little kettle for my rooibos tea so I'm going to put that back on the stove I still want to make a glass electric kettle as well but that will come and this is also from that 1 to 12 scale some piece and I just colored it with brown and then there's my breadboard I'm going to put it on top of the um, in this um, little um, dish rack I made this actually um, this was a tray that a pink tray that was too big to fit in any of the cupboards and then this is just a piece of a, a hair roller that I cut in half and I cut all that little things out of in the middle and file it down and spaced on here and just spray the silver and there's my little dish rack so yeah you can put in your plates and there you can put in glasses or knives and forks and that stuff so yeah and then this is just a, like a sample blind and I use that for a carpet for here in front of the um, maybe I must wipe the floor rather before I put that down like for in front of the um, base and the zinc in the kitchen I, this extra one but I'm not going to use that I'm going to put in this drawer here to make it fit um, and this is a little cups rack that I made myself um, this is just oh, it was actually so easy this is just a round circle um, wood that you get in packets of different sizes and this is balsa wood stick and I just took um, uh, toothpicks and I just pressed it in the balsa because the balsa wood is very soft and I just sprayed it silver and then the cups this is made out of um, big um, like a paper straw and I just put some hot glue on a glossy finish just to make it close it underneath and the handles are made out of plastic rings that came around like tablet but those are soft plastic rings so yeah there is my little um, rack with cups and then I, oh, I just cute text the um, cups to make it green to fit in by the kitchen so yeah I'm gonna... and this is just a little art I made for this wool here I will put the link up here in up top here to show you the tutorial of how I made this little um, art to put here I'm just going to use some more um, this is for an earring then I'm going to put it, I worked it out how I'm going to do it, oh, this here on top, just going to bend it a bit more, and there's my little art against the wall and then last but not least I will put the 
another link here in the corner for you where I showed you I'll show you how I made this little doggy bed for Mitzi so like I said I want to put a doggy bed here and there it is her little doggy bed nice and cozy inside there so yeah if you want to see how I made this little um, art and the doggy bed just go to the links and I will show you or I will put a link in the description box as well and um, yes there's our kitchen just give it a quick wipe here again so just close all the doors here and I think everything is now nice and on their places and I am so happy with the ki this kitchen now at last now I'm finished with the kitchen so now I can go to the bathroom there's not much to do in the bathroom then I have so much to do here because everything is just the walls I have to fix the walls and then the shower and yeah I don't have to I'm not going to make extra thing or change anything for now so that's then for the next one and I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did please give it a thumbs up good old thumbs up and um, if you want to see more subscribe and push that bell for notifications so for the next time bye